Well, as usual, there were a lot of home runs, but there was also that high-level drama in the final action at Marita Hines Field. The top-ranked Sooners have the new NCAA consecutive wins record at 48. But, Steve, it was anything but a sure thing on Saturday. Like I said last night on the air, it ain't over till it's over. And it sure looked like Oklahoma would be playing Clemson today in the Norman Super Regional Game 3. Nope. With two outs, two strikes in the seventh, down three. Oklahoma stays alive with Haley Lee a single. Then next up, with two strikes against her, Kinsey Hansen hits the shot heard around Norman and beyond. Tying the game at seven, Tiara Jennings hits the go-ahead homer in the ninth for an 8-7 victory. Our Chris Williams caught up with Saturday's hero, Kinsey Hansen. Well, Kinsey Hansen, fresh off that magical home run, can you just tell us what was going through your mind as you were seeing your name, you're coming up, and, and you know the game's going to be on your bat? Uh, truthfully, I was getting an on, on deck circle, and I was praying. Um, I knew that going into it that I was going to get a chance um, to either end the game or to, you know, keep the game rolling for us. So um, our team never quits, and I just wanted to do it for them and I knew that Haley's base hit and um, Boone was on second and I knew that we were just going to keep it rolling so you know just we're never out of the fight until the last pitch. At what point did you know okay that ball's gone? Uh, actually right when I hit it I saw it go up and I was just like no way so honestly right off the bat I thought it was going. And could you hear the crowd and everyone screaming or do you just kind of black out like, like what is that like hitting a home run like that? Um, I really didn't hear the crowd. I heard my teammates. You know, that's what it's really about is just the joy within the dugout. You know, uh, we just love each other so much. And I feel like that's really what shows why we do this and why we do this for each other. And so when I heard them, I r ran so fast around the bases because I just wanted to get to home to be with them. Headed back to the World Series now. Do you guys like going in as the number one target on your back defending champs? You know, we don't really think of it as that. We think um, we're not really defending every, anything, but we're attacking everything. You know, it's just we don't really think about what we've done in the past because the past doesn't matter. It's about the present. And outcomes and results don't matter. We're just living for each other and loving each other and just doing what needs to be done. How close is this group this year? Um, pre it's pretty crazy, actually. You know, it's just I think there's just so much love between all 20 of us you know since the beginning we've been like 20 versus the world because mm -hmm. sometimes that's what it feels like you know so being able to gel through that and just have that mentality of everyone one through nine one through 20 we all have each other's backs no matter what and i think that that's super special well thank you for sitting down with us and good luck in oklahoma yeah, city of course thank you so much appreciate you